<laughs> Ooh, I like it, I like it, I like it. <laughs> Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Kyra Sean. So today's video is a little different. As you can see, we're gonna do some nails today. Okay, we're gonna do these ones right here. So if you wanna see how I did these matte press-ons, make sure you stay tuned for that. But first, we got a little surprise, okay? So Ken Ken, AKA my husband, AKA y'all best friend, decided to partner up with Julia Jewelry to send your girl something real nice, okay? And I wanted to share that with you guys and also share my coupon code. So if you guys wanna pick up something for yourself, you can do that. Now this is not my first time working with Julia. I have featured their products on my channel before and I love them because they're so, so pretty, very inexpensive, and they just give the looks that I want. A lot of you guys love my heartbeat necklace and I actually got it from them. So in the packaging, you do get the little bag and you get, um, oh, is it two things? Is it two things? <laughs> two little baggies here. Okay, so you also get the little info cards, the little magazine that shows you, you know, things that they have. Ooh, they have, ooh, is that a ring with the bracelet and with the necklace and the earrings? Ooh, I like that. Okay, so you get the little sets in here if you want to. Okay, the little emerald. Okay, that kind of matches my nails. Okay, I'm not mad. I'm not mad. <laughs> I'm mad at this. Okay, so if you want to check them out, again, very inexpensive. If you want to check out their jewelry, y'all, listen. Oh, that little Christmas joint. Look, look. Okay, so let's see what Kenny done sent me. So let's see what, he, what we got here. Let's see. Oh, he sent me some pearl earrings. Y'all know, y'all always see me with my pearl little earrings that I wear. So y'all, look at these. Let me get these out. Let me just, I'm just gonna cut it. I'm just gonna cut it, cut it out. He know I love my little pearl earrings, so he sent me some pearl joints. Okay, okay, so we got the little pearl earrings right there. I hope these are for me and not for Emery. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna ask them, but I'm pretty sure they're from me. So, okay, and then what's in this one? What's in this one? Oh, is that a bracelet? Is that a bracelet? All the details of what I got will be on the screen right here so you guys know exactly what I got. Ooh, that's not, nice. ooh, that's nice, y'all. Okay, I like that, it has my birthstone on it. That was thoughtful, that was thoughtful, babe. Thank you. How do you open this thing? Oh, you just open it like this, like you just move it and put your hand in it and close it back okay thank you thank you thank you my baby is very simple he knows what I like and I appreciate it thank you honey also thank you to Julia for partnering with my husband to send me this I really appreciate it thank y'all so like I said if you want to check out some jewelry for yourself whether it's the pieces that I got today have gotten in the past or you just want to check out the site for yourself make sure you check the description box for all the direct links now before we get into these nails if you're new to the channel make sure you go ahead and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up also give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so if you're new to my channel and you haven't seen me do my press-ons before, I have a video where I show all the products that I use. This is one of them. So this is the BT Art Box False Nails that I got from Amazon. Um, but you get all of these nails in different sizes. Most likely you will find a nail size in here that fits your nail bed. If you do not, then obviously just shop around Amazon and find the ones that fit for you. So I already have the sizes that I need picked out. Now we're gonna go ahead and get our setup together for our nail polish. Now for the nail polish we are using I have featured them on my channel before these polishes were sent to us from the nail attic they were sent to me like months and months ago y'all I'm just now getting around to using them but they sent me a couple new ones this emerald widow is really really pretty I'm really liking how that green is looking so I may try that one even though it is summer I know but you know it still looks good some of these are glitter so dare to shine ocean's heart and rainforest queen are all glitters oh you have a matte top coat I may want to try that I really 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 want to try this green with this matte. Now, if you didn't see the video that I did with them last time, I will link it down below and in the card so you can definitely can check that out. I took you guys advice and I did get me some nail stands. I got these from Amazon too, okay? So I can just put my nails on here and they're easier to come off when I, um, after I polish them. Y'all was getting on me last time, like, girl, why are you doing it like that? <laughs> I'm gonna take some of this little sticky situation right here. Where are my scissors? Okay, you know what? Now wait a minute. 
Okay, so we got those all together. Now I need to make sure I have my base and my top coat. And then I have my lamp here. Again, this is from Amazon. Everything that I'm using will be linked down below so you guys can check it out for yourself. Let me put these ones to the side so I don't mix them up like I did last time. And I don't know what design I'm gonna do. I just, yeah. This is definitely a lot easier than using that little tab thing. So I can get all on the sides and I have to worry about it making a mess. So thank y'all, y'all put your girl on. I like that. Okay, so I'm bringing my lamp over here. We're gonna slide that in there for 60 seconds. We're gonna try this Emerald Widow color. So this is how that's looking. I'm hoping it comes out the way that I want her to. I mean, trial and error, I guess. Oh, she is pretty. Yeah, I like that. I like that. So that's how that is looking so far. I'm gonna put that under the lamp for 60 seconds. one on for 90 seconds so that's how that one looks after it has cured for the first um, coat okay and then you keep um, pretty much painting until you get the desired look so you can do one or two coats I think I'll be good at two coats but so that is what two coats look like um, you can definitely still see the green in there so yeah I think I like that I am going to try it says the matte top coat I'm gonna test it with one and see because I don't want to mess up all my work that I'm doing so yeah, let's try a pinky. Let's try this one over here. So I just tried the pinky nail. I'm gonna take her off of this and just slide her under here and see if she does anything. There's no like rule book on how you're supposed to do this. Like, I don't know. <laughs> so <laughs> we're going to find out together. Okay. I hope she comes out how I want her to come out. Cause if not, we're going to have to change up the color. This may be a little bit too dark. So, okay. So it does make it matte. So compared to obviously what it was. <gasps> Ooh, I like it. I like it. I like it. <laughs> So let's go ahead and put that mat on there then. Uh-huh. Messing around with this polish, I'm gonna put matte on everything. <laughs> so it didn't cure all the way, so I'm gonna put it back in there. Okay, so while those are waiting, I wanna show you guys the new uh, nail art that I picked up from, of course, Amazon. So these are like the actual designs. I want the, the gold, the gold stuff. Give me the gold stuff, that's what I want. So let me pick all those out. Ooh, that's fancy. Where are the faces? I don't know. And I'm not sure even how to use these. <laughs> So we gonna find out together, okay? Or I could just be simple and do the lines. I think these have the gold lines in it as well. Oh, these are like shiny gold. 
but these are like you know the gold gold so i think i'll do the gold gold and then you got the silver silver this is like a copper color that's cute it, i wanted the nails to be matte but i don't know if i can do the design on it if it's matte like can i do another matte top coat will it mess it up i don't know we're about to find out next time on dragon ball z all right so what i'm gonna do so i don't mess this up i'm gonna cut this little face out right here okay then you just peel this off right how am i supposed to get it off it's like like i don't want it to rip when i'm trying to do it let me get my tweezers where they at Oh, tweezers. Okay, I'm just gonna stick it on there like that. Okay, so I don't think I like how this is looking because the face is not giving face. <laughs> yeah, it's not really giving what I want it to give. So I'm not gonna use that. Okay, so I'm gonna try this little line right here. Let's see if this will work the way that I want her to. there i need my sharper scissors because these are not as sharp as i need them to be and i'm gonna do another one like that okay okay that's how that's looking okay so these are pretty much like peel and stick so you just peel them off and stick them on there where you want to stick them. So I'm just going to do that for the rest of these. Okay, so that's how they're looking so far. I think, mm, should I? We're gonna put the top coat on here and I'm hoping that it does not ruin these daggone nails. Here's to hoping. Okay, so all seems well with the top coat. So, so I'm gonna go ahead and put these on now using my Kiss Powerflex Max Speed glue. I will say right now, these nail form things, lifesaver. Okay, so now time to foul. I can already tell things that um, I can do better next time. I'm not mad at them. Like this one looks really good. This little finger right here, that little finger right there looks pretty good. I ain't, gonna, I ain't gonna hold you, you know what I'm saying? For my first time using this matte polish and doing these designs, I think they're okay. Coming off more black to me than green, you can definitely see some of the green in there. Maybe two coats was too much, maybe, possibly. If I would've done one coat and then the matte, maybe that would've been a little bit better. But I will say, let the polish cure for the entire time. If you got a little wet spot, don't, 
mess with them. You can see on my hands, I have some of the nail polish um, like around my tips and everything because the polish was still wet on a little bit of the sides. So definitely make sure the nails are dry all the way before you handle them or try to put them on. Again, everything that I use in this video will be linked down below. If you wanna check out some jewelry for your bae, for your family member, for your friend, for your associate, you know, whatever. I will definitely put the link for Julia down below so you can do that. I do have codes for both Julia and Nail Addict so you can save some money on both your orders. So definitely shout out one more time to Nail Addict LA and Julia for sending me over these products to review for you guys i really appreciate it don't forget to like comment subscribe and share this video also smash that notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up i love you guys so much and i will see you next time bye